Well, from one Shannon to another, I've been so busy shopping. I'll tell you what, the race for holiday shopping has gotten a lot, or I should say that window has gotten a lot shorter than we normally have. But you know what? I'm pretty sure this is the last show of the year. In fact, if you haven't met or heard about our king of coins, the ultimate numismatist, easy for me to say. Mike, I remember the last time we worked together. Now, do you have any more shows planned for the rest of the year, or is this it? This is it. The next show that we have will be the today's special value, uh, New Year's Eve day, you know, the, the day of New Year's Eve. So if you are doing any holiday shopping whatsoever for coins, this is the show you have to do it in or go to hsn.com. There's no other there's no other way to do it. All right. Well, you know what? We're to jump right in. And <laughs> when I said it's like Christmas coming early, Santa Claus is here. Santa Claus is coming to town. <laughs> And Mike, you even put him on sale. <laughs> well, <clears throat> it's interesting. I, we were going through the warehouse, you know, it's end of year and all that other stuff. We go, what, what happened here? We had this great Santa Claus coin from 2020 that we had assumed sold out. And as it turns out, we have, I think it's about 100 pieces or so, not even. And it's an actual coin that you can see, individually serial numbered. There's only 2,500 of them that were ever made. I have 156. There we go. Uh, is the exact number on those. And it's a solid silver coin. So it's the Santa Claus coin, which I absolutely positively love. I can't believe I was able to put Santa Claus on sale, but that's exactly what we've got here. One ounce pure silver is going to be in this. It is this fantastic display box. And I think this is real Chris Kringley, I guess, is the way you kind of look at it from a Santa Claus perspective. Because uh, uh, this is made by Palm Suisse, which is a Swiss company. So I think it's more of a, of a European style. Style Santa Claus, if you will, or an old school Santa Claus, however you want to do it. It was sold out in 2020. The only reason I have any is I had them sitting in my warehouse and didn't even realize it. So great opportunity for this fantastic Santa Claus coin. If you look at the reverse, of course, Pomp Suisse does such an amazing job with, uh, you know, has all the snowflakes on there. Each coin is individually numbered. So if you look at the bottom of the coin there, there's a little number. This one's like 1893. That's not the year of the coin. That's the serial number of the coin. Okay, so that's, that's coin number 1,893 out of 2,500 in the worldwide edition that have been sold out for almost an entire year, <clears throat> almost an entire year, and they didn't do a 2021 coin. So this is the only Santa Claus coin that I have. I know it's dated 2020, but a, uh, I think a fabulous gift uh, nonetheless. It is indeed, no matter who's naughty or nice. Check that list, check it twice, but there are only a few of you who can grab it. So, uh, by the way, if you are new to HSN, um, remember this is a perfect place to start with your coin collecting. FlexPay is open to anyone watching, you know, anyone within the sound of our voice. Those are interest-free payments. Whenever you see those quantity left counters, though, they are real. Uh, there's no tomfoolery going on there. It's one of the questions we always get here at HSN. And even though in the broad spectrum or in the broadest sense of the word, I got to tell you, coin collecting can be kind of the Wild West. So the fact that you still get our extended uh -huh. holiday return policy, Mike, there are just so many incentives to not only grab this, but shop here, right? Well, yeah, because, I mean, in the coin world, and it's becoming more and more and more prevalent, as you as you mentioned, is the fact that, I mean, there's counterfeits out there. There's stuff that, that is in coins that is of dubious origin. When you buy here, you buy coins that you know are authentic because we are dealing really only with the distributors of the coins, whether it be the United States Mint, whether it be Palm Suisse, whoever it is. Uh, we certify the coins. So we even have an independent third-party company that goes ahead and guarantees that the, the coins for weight, content, purity, authenticity authenticity and grade. So all of those things are important. And as coins become more and more limited, as coin collecting becomes more and more popular, you have more of the nefarious sorts coming into the coming into the business and and basically just taking advantage and doing there's just tons and tons and tons of counterfeits. So to be able to know that you're going to get an authentic coin I, I think that's just, you know, that, that's just a sense of confidence that you can have shopping with us. I've been here 20 years now, basically. So uh, at the end of the day, you, you get exactly what you say we say you're going to get. Absolutely. Okay. Well, one of those rare opportunities in life where you, 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 you know, we, you get what you, you, you want. All right. Well, yours is here. Remember, very limited quantities and only because Mike is the ultimate 
curator for you, whether you're an avid coin collector or not. Remember, last scheduled show for the year. Uh, of course, you're always welcome to go to hsn.com and you can shop at your leisure. Of course, I always tell Mike that um, when he doesn't take it personally, we actually sell more coins when he's not on the air than even when he is because people watch the shows and they digest the information and then they come back and then, you know, stuff sells out. Well, we are going to continue, and remember, last scheduled show for the year, everything has our unconditional money-back guarantee until the end of January. And now, Mike, this is one that looks like if I'm a discerning connoisseur, if I'm one of your avid fans, it looks like this is something that you have done or curated specifically for your educated shopper. And if not, I know you're going to fill me in on all the details, too. So uh, what are we talking about here? Well, we we debuted this uh, our sh last show, which was two weeks ago. Um, this is this I think is one of the most exciting, one of the most special, one of the most incredible sets that's ever been put out by the United States government. Uh, starting in 1878 and ending in 1921, the United States government made made the Morgan silver dollar. It has always been kind of the hallmark of collectability in America. American numismatics. In other words, the Morgan silver dollar is what everybody aspired to. It was the most popularly collected uh, uh, vintage coin that had ever been made by the United States Mint. It was last made in 1921. Uh, none of the Morgan silver dollars uh, remain today in Mint State 70 condition, literally a couple of dozen in Mint State 69. So the United States government decides to commemorate for the 100th anniversary of the Morgan silver dollar. They make a complete mint mark set of the Morgan silver dollar and date it 2021. Now, I understand this is not technically a commemorative. While it commemorates the 100th anniversary of the Morgan silver dollar, these are actual coins. These are literally 2021 Morgan silver dollars. After a 100-year hiatus, the United States government has started making these coins again for this year, for this special opportunity. And what has happened is, is the United States government made these available in two coin pairs, two at a time, to the general public. And these coins sold out uh, each time each pair was offered, sold out in literally minutes, sold out in literally minutes at, at any given time. Well, what they did is a very, very, very few of these coins were released in what were called advanced release. 10% of the mintage, so literally only 17,000 sets, 17,500 of these sets were released in what was called an advanced release to, uh, 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 to, to some dealers, of which we are one of them, that are the best customers of the United States Mint. So we were able to get these coins. We have these coins. They're in stock. They're ready to ship. Uh, the United States Mint has not shipped all the coins. I don't know when or if they're going to ship. Well, yes, they will ship all the coins. Who knows when? We have these in stock ready to go. We got a, we had a tremendous quantity. We had a thousand of these sets, not the certified Mint State 70, but a thousand sets in all. I have 108 sets of these remain. The, it, it's difficult <clears throat> to even begin to talk about the importance of this coin in American numismatics. First of all, you had the Morgan silver dollar, which the United States government made almost a billion Morgan silver dollars. In Mint State 70, none of those exist today. None of those exist today. More importantly, not only are every one of these coins certified Mint State 70 perfect and my exclusive holder designating my advance release on these, the fact that we got these before anybody else, but the United States Mint commemorated every single mint mark, every single mint mark that the United States government made the Morgan silver dollar at. So you've got a Philadelphia minted coin, a Denver minted coin, San Francisco. You've got the Carson City and New Orleans mint. Since those don't exist, there were, those exist in what we call the privy seals with that. Additionally, it is also the 100th anniversary of the start of the United States government peace dollar. And so they made a single peace dollar to go with the five Morgan silver dollars. So what you've got is the six coin Morgan silver dollar set in my exclusive holder. Now, last time we sold this, uh, we had sold out just about every single one. I have a third of the quantity left of what we had last time. And we are here to sell this out. This will be the final prime time presentation, not in this year ever, that we have got of this NGC set that you have here. Whether it be New Orleans, whether it be Carson City, whether it be all of those coins, it does not matter. This is the final opportunity that you're going to have to be able to buy this set, like I said, in my exclusive label from these advanced release coins, these coins that were released before any of the other coins. It's this special subset of rarity. What I really want to talk about, though, is the grade. 
the fact that these coins are certified perfect 70. Now, the United States government made the better part of a billion Morgan silver dollars over the course from 1878 to 1921. When they rolled off the press, there was a fair number of mint state 70s. But over the course of the intervening century, those 70s absolutely disappeared. So of those nearly billion Morgan silver dollars made by the United States Mint, by the major grading services, whether it be NGC, whether it be PCGS, whether it be Annex, even if it's ICG, you know how many Mint State 70 Morgan silver dollars are in existence? That would be zero, not a single solitary coin. In Mint State 69, one grade lower than this, in Mint State 69, one grade lower than this, there are two dozen coins from the major grading companies in existence, and they all sell for $100,000 plus regardless of mint mark or date. Here you get five mint states. This represents all of the mint state 70 perfect Morgan silver dollars ever made by the United States government that exists today. Same thing with the peace dollars. There's not a mint state 70 peace dollar, which was last made in 1935. So this is an absolutely positively perfect set. And here's the key to this. These are the early coins. These are the advanced release coins that we were able to get directly from the United States Mint. We have got these coins in stock ready to ship. We have got these coins in stock ready to ship. To date, the United States Mint has not shipped all of these coins anywhere else that I'm aware of that are available in any way, shape, or form. To my uh, to my knowledge, I don't think they've started shipping the Peace Dollars or the Denver Minute Dollars. The CCs and the Os, I think, are mostly out there, bringing tremendous premiums in the marketplace in Mint State 70 condition. And that's before we look at the advanced release that we have, that we have put into our exclusive holder, this, this more and peace dollar holder that you've got uh, uh, that's within this. So because of that, I have 100 sets remain, and those are the only sets remaining in existence that are going to go in our specialized NGC six-coin holder that you see uh, uh, that you see right here. I've got them right here. I've got them right now. This is the last look, last call, last uh, uh, show of the year. They're certified absolutely positively perfect. The United States government made 175,000 of these each, each of these coins. Only 10% of them, only 10% of them qualify as this advanced release, if you will, okay, that the United States Mint released early. We have got these coins in stock and ready to go. They are bringing significant premiums in the marketplace. I have seen coin sets out there for maybe $3,000, but they're not sets that exist. They're sets that are pre-sales. They're sets that might come up. They are not advanced release. They're not my exclusive holder. They are not in hand and ready to ship. And that's exactly, exactly what we have here. So one of the most historic coins, and, and make no mistake about it, this is a coin made by the United States Mint. This is a coin. This is not a commemorative thing or whatever. If you take take any one of those coins, if you would, preferably the CC, Shannon, okay. and flip it over. The one that says Carson City Privy Mark. You'll now, see you know, one I of them. I forgot to bring uh, my readers to the set, Mike. So. Oh, sorry about that. Maybe uh, upper this right one? hand. Oh, this one. Uh, okay. That one right there. Yep. Okay, all right. Upper right hand corner. Okay. So when you look at the reverse, there's no counter stamps or anything like that to that. This is exactly the way the Morgan Silver Dollar looked when it rolled off the mint in Carson City in 1878, 1879, and 1880. The last Carson City Morgan Silver Dollar prior to this coin ever made was 1893. Was 1893. And so now you've got a Carson City Silver Dollar. Now here's the thing. Any of those original Carson City Morgans, of which they made millions and millions and millions, in high grade, and I'm talking about Mint State 65, maybe even Mint State 66, you can't buy those coins for $3,599.95, let alone a set of six, let alone any of those. Absolutely crucial that you understand what you're getting here is that you get the entire set. It's $599.95 a coin for an advanced release uh, uh, dollar in my exclusive specific holder that you see right here. And here's the great thing about this. This has been a land rush, much as the original Morgan Silver Dollars were. We have got the extended holiday return on this. So that is, Shannon, the return go until, 
what is that? End of January is when they can January return it to? January 31st. Yeah, absolutely. Thank and, you very uh, much. Mike, just a couple of things. You know, in fact, it's funny because I was going to mention as, as you were even doing it, these are not commemorative or medallion or... It's, it's funny, when I said that coin collecting is like the Wild West, you really do have to read the fine print. Now, remember, in order to be a, a, a curated purveyor of this, you're really relying on the expertise and really the legacy that Mike Nizak has built, not only internally here at HSN for well over two decades. I've known Mike for several decades because I've, I've worked with him even before HSN. But you have to understand, even to have these, not an advanced order or, you know, keep your fingers crossed, maybe you'll get it, maybe you won't. We have about 100 of these ready to ship now. That's number one. These are not um, a replica, uh, you know, in right. commemoration, an, an anniversary look. They're the real deal. And, Mike, the other thing is they did, and I actually confirmed this with my producer before the show because the last show we had together, um, we had a couple of items where we, they were going to do VIP financing, and then, like the Godfather, we, they thought we were out. They pulled us back in, and then we were out. Because uh, somebody, somebody's holding the balance books, I mean, for that. So we do have 18-month VIP financing on this wow. because, I mean, let's be honest, a considered purchase to be sure, but those of you who are educated and shoppers, you already know, 18 months makes it about $200. And to Mike's point, you could do FlexPay, PayPal, debit card, but here's the most important thing that you need to understand. And, and Mike, that's why I keep going back to you and I keep referencing really the legacy that you have created, not only here, but within the industry. You do so many things that were groundbreaking that everybody else, you know, who offers coins to people now, you know, basically piggyback on but when you say the last show of the year that's the a last, nice way to put it yeah exactly <laughs> imitation's a, a sincere form of flattery right you know I guess so. but right. to just put this in perspective something else that you said and listen i don't care if it's the grocery store or the gas station you know how sometimes we say don't worry we'll make more and you know the last show of the year and the last you know prime time airing ever so Mike will not be minting these in his garage when he comes back in 2021. You're not going to be out there, with, you know, with a, like, you know, stamping these out. So when we say last chance ever, it's not like something that we can or will restock. It's the real deal. It's the authenticated merchant, you know, coin, coin, not anniversary or, you know, <laughs> legacy edition or whatever. And it's also that curated collection, bird in hand, not a wait list, not an advanced order, not keep your fingers crossed, maybe you'll get it, in perfection, in perfect condition to once more preserve the legacy of what I kind of call, Mike, because um, we've known each other a long time, the Morgan I always call kind of a fan favorite anyway. It's whenever I think of coins, that's, I, I think for people who don't even collect coins, that's maybe the image that they conjure up when they think of a coin, they might think of that image. So there's every reason, yes, considered purchase or not, but every reason to take advantage of this for the couple dozen that we have, right? Yeah, and, and here's the other thing. Yeah, like you said, I think we're probably under 100 right now or very close to it in terms of the, in terms of the final things. I, I, and one of the things I said is, is that's so important is that we have these in stock. I ordered about 15 sets from 15 different places over the last, oh, 30 days or so. I've not received a single set from anybody else. Because unless you have the advance release the coins, the coins that came through basically a few over a dozen dealers in the United States were able to get the early release coins from the United States Mint. Unless you have one of those, you just don't have the opportunity to have get complete uh, and then certify us complete and total sets in these. So who knows if they're going to get there for the holiday or any of that other stuff. So, and on top of that, this uh, this uh, uh, specific NGC holder that you have right here is 100% exclusive to me. So you can only buy this from me and my company that you see right there with the Morgan and the Peace Dollar side by side with that. The fact that I've got every single solitary one of these in stock ready to go. The fact that now I have, like I said, with everybody on the phone, well fewer than 100 of these left in existence that can never, ever, ever be made again. And once again, understand, like you said, the Mint is not making any more of these coins. They're done, they're gone, and they're sold out. But then also, let's go ahead and look at the fact that these coins are in Mint State 70 condition. Even though they're brand new, even though the United States government took extra care and concern in making each and every one of these, there are coins in here that are very difficult to get or much more difficult to get in Mint State 70. And I point your attention to the New Orleans Privy Seal that you see right there. 
the O-minted coin, and interestingly enough, the D-minted coin. So what you have is fewer than half the coins that were made uh, for with that O-mint uh, mint mark and with the D-mint mark, fewer than half of those are, are meeting the standards of Mint State 70. So you start with a, uh, a coin, so you, you made 175,000 of each coin. That means there are two Morgan silver dollars that were made that are rarer than this coin. And understand, make no mistake, these are Morgan silver dollars, 1894 and the 1893S. That's it. And those coins start at $100,000 a piece. And then the next rarest Morgan silver dollar are these five. In the peace dollars, the rarest peace dollar ever made by the United States government, you're looking at it. It's rarer than any. It's rarer than 28s. It's really the, rarer than the 21. They even did it in high relief, like the original peace dollar that they'd done. And they, they did the original peace dollar in high relief as well. So they did that just like it was intended to be. Good. That is the rarest peace dollar ever made by the United States government. It's not reprinted, restruck, or redone. It is an actual United States government peace dollar, and you have the opportunity to own that coin which to my knowledge has not been released live by the United States Mint except within the advanced release program. So that's the key. You get them all here. You get them right now. You don't have to worry about, are you going to get them? Are they going to get them? Are you going to get your money back or not get your money back? Like I said, I've ordered about 15 sets. I've received zero sets. I've received zero sets out there in the marketplace. Look, I went out there and shopped around so you didn't have to. And so that's the end result. So here we have, I got three minutes left in this. That'll be the very last time that you're going to see this pr a primetime presentation of this particular coin set. You're looking at it right here, right now, 100 sets. Okay, now less than 100 sets. I think we had 108 or 109 sets. And understand, I did not have more than 108 or 109 sets. That was it. I have 100 sets. Now understand, at $3,599.95, I get, as you said, Shannon, it's a considered purchase. It's not for everybody. I understand that 100%. But if you are a numismatist, if you are a collector, if you do anything serious in American coins, American numismatica, this is the set that you have to buy. And if you're going to buy it, you buy it in 70. If you're going to buy it in 70, you're going to get it in its rarest format, which is going to be Mint State 70. And then you're going to get it, what I think is the rarest, most desirable label, because only my company can do this special NGC label. There's lots of other guys out there that are doing all these other labels. You see this early release, that, and, you know, first day of this or that or whatever. But this one right here are advanced release Morgan Silver Dollars that came out of my allocation directly from the United States Mint, guaranteed rarity, guaranteed collectability. And out of all the coins I got, and understand, I got less than a thousand sets to start with. And of that, the entire world of these was 470 sets. When we debuted this two weeks ago, 300 of those 70 sets were gone, okay? 300 of those 70 sets were gone. They are absolutely, in advance release like this, irreplaceable. Fewer than 100 to go around in worldwide existence for worldwide, uh, 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 for worldwide distribution. Please understand what your opportunity is. One of the most historic coins ever made by the United States Mint, one of the most emblematic coins, one of the most ubiquitously collected. If, if someone comes up to me and said, my grandfather left me coins, Chances are it's a Morgan silver dollar. Chances are it's a peace silver dollar. That's what people have collected literally in this country for over a century. And now you have the very first opportunity in history to own a perfect set from every single mint that the United States government made these at. Philadelphia, Denver, San Francisco, Carson City, and New Orleans. Add into that the 100th anniversary of the start of the peace dollar as well. This is the most perfect six-coin set ever put out by the United States Mint. Now is your time. Now is your chance. Now is your opportunity. You really, really, really have to take advantage of this in this, our very final primetime presentation. Well, and remember Again, a curated collection you are only finding here and now, bird in hand, available for shipment, and that is literally for the couple dozen of you who are able to select it. 18 month VIP financing is confirmed. I, you know, I, I you know, dotted my I's, crossed my T's, and that was not the case when Mike and I did um, a show very recently. So that means for about $200 on your HSN card, you can meter those payments out. But remember, and I know Mike was also referencing in terms of you know, what you might find, it's funny, in beauty we do something called If Purchased Separately to get that entire collection together. Again, considered purchase or not, 
is definitely something that you should sit up and take notice over, especially with that perfect condition and our extended holiday return policy until the end of January. So it gives you every confidence to A, not only know you're gonna get it, B, know you're gonna get what you paid for or what you wanted, but C, also, because it's a considered purchase, you know, really assess what you're, you're getting for the couple dozen of you who are selecting it. All right, Mike, we're gonna move along. And when I said that you have really kind of created, um, laid the groundwork for a lot of things that people in what coin collecting copy, one of them is what you what we call an auto ship program. So for people who have never heard about this yet, it's probably good that we sh share how thoughtful you are to help your customer get the coins that they want, right? Well, and, and as you said before, it's a considered person purchase. I understand $3,599.95. Not everybody can, you know, kind of take that bite at the apple all at once, right? So what we did is gave you the opportunity, we just, and you don't pay any extra, you get one coin per month for six months until you get all six coins, easy as you can be. Cancel as many, cancel anytime you like, okay? Return the coins if you don't like them. Understand your price can never go up, your delivery's guaranteed as long as you choose to stay in the program. So you get the auto ship. Now here's the thing, we were going through some of our numbers the other day. We have had, in the course of my time here at HSN, in terms of auto ships. And I, I understand I have to save, you know, a, a, a few of these sets for auto ship because I have to have all six coins. It's not like I go out and get them as they come in. I own all six of them and send them to you one at a time, okay? I just hold them in my vault for you is what it comes down to. So please understand that. But as we were going through our numbers the other day, do you realize we have made millions and millions of auto shipments, coin shipments, to HSN customers over the two decades that I've been here. Millions and millions of shipments, not dollars, shipments that we have done uh, uh, over the course of the years because people trust us. And here's the amazing part, the thing that I find amazing. In 1999, we started selling the state quarters here at HSN. Right. I still have people in that auto ship this year, in 2021, for the final, the final, because we did the state quarters, then we did the national parks quarters, and the last national parks quarter came out this year. So those people have been with me, and I mean, bless every one of you, 22 years, 22 years in our auto ship. Thank each and every one of you for that. I appreciate it. But that's the type of of loyalty that we have. That's the type of continuity that we have. That's the type of, of trust that our customers have in us, literally to let us build their collection over a generation. And this is a, a another way to do that. This is a perfect way to do that so that you can get this coin. You don't have to take that big $3,600 bite at the Apple. $599.95 once every month. You get one right now, and then you know once over every the five months, you get the entire set. Great opportunity, as I want everybody. This is such an important coin. This is such an important opportunity for you to be able to get this set. I think this is one of the single most important sets ever released by the United States government, as you did with VIP financing. That's what HSN did. I did auto ship. You know, we have our same original issue price, even though the price has gone, you know, up in the marketplace. We've held our original pricing. We've done everything to make sure that everybody can put this coin in their collection. Well, and Mike, just kind of like you were referencing, it takes a huge amount of commitment on HSN's part to offer that VIP financing if you have your HSN card. But then it also takes a huge commitment on Mike's part to, to offer that auto ship because you have to remember the state quarter program is a good case in point for over two decades he is still ensured that he is as committed to you as you are to building your coin collection so it's really a two-way street and then we also honor that extended holiday return policy until the end of january so anyway stack it if that auto ship program is what um appeals to you at least in terms of your immediate budget we have a handful of those to go around too now we also have amazing gifts top brands and deals that you'll also only find at hsn.com of course we make it easy to shop for gifts this holiday thousands of products all the time and offers that you only see at hsn.com you can get more of what you love the gifts they'll love now 
at hsn.com. Uh, by the way, that's where a lot of you, I know, watch and shop for your coins when Mike is not here. And hey, one quick thing about that um, Morgan and Peace dollar set that we just had. Uh, Kevin, we have what, fewer, than, about 80 of those or so? Now, as I reference that, just be aware I am confident when I say every single one of those will be gone by the time Mike and I are done with this final scheduled show of the year, and I can tell you why. Especially with a considered purchase, people generally listen to Mike, they watch, they listen, they learn, and then they shop after the fact. I mean, I can t I've experienced that firsthand, whether I'm shopping for coins or you're watching coins, so just be aware. I think we all think we have more time in life, you know, more years on our, <laughs> our life. I think we always think we have more time. Just, again... You might want to do that now. So um, all things being equal, and that being said, Mike, it's, it's, we've known each other for a long time, and you're just talking about you know, well over two decades here at HSN. What is it? Is it 30, 40 years that you've been? Do, do I ask? Am I, am I, am I graying <laughs> more hairs on that handsome yeah, head? You're, you're, you know? you're putting more gray in my hair than I, what's actually there, it seems. Well, I, yeah, I, I've been I, doing this. I, I know, not your first rodeo, right? <laughs> Yeah, because when I first started doing this, I was doing not only coins, I did all collectibles. So to give you a, a general idea, the, one of the first things I ever sold on television was the Shaquille O'Neal rookie card. Just kind of put that into perspective. Oh, wow. Um, and I also happened to sell the very first year of the American Silver Eagle in 1986. So it's been a bit that I've been doing this. Uh, so when we have the kind of these numismatic events, understand what that allows me to do is draw on a great amount of history and a great amount of experience. And I think that's one of the reasons I've been here for almost 20 years now is the fact that, you know, I, you know, kind of fads kind of come and go, but I understand, or I like to think that I understand the coins that are important. And this coin right here is also a really important coin. I know the Morgan Silver Dollar has kind of taken all the air out of the room from a numismatic standpoint. Everybody's so excited. I mean, we just sold, you know, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, dozens and dozens of sets at $3,600 a piece. So, I mean, you know, that's, that's pretty exciting. But let's not overlook, I think, what was one of the most significant numismatic events, certainly of my lifetime, absolutely my career. A once-in-a-lifetime career-wise opportunity for me. The United States government changed the design of the American Silver Eagle in this year, 2021. When they first started making it in 1986 until June the 30th of 2021, it looked one way. It was type one, what they call the old design. It was, you know, Lady Liberty, and on the back was kind of that heraldic state eagle that John Mercanti designed and put on the American Silver Eagle in 1986. Well, in uh, July 1st, 2021, the United States government put out this new design for the first time in 35 years. 35 years in the making, they changed the design of the American silver gold, the most popularly collected silver coin in the world today, and the design has changed for the first time in 35 years. And by the by, which is why I say it's a once-in-a-lifetime, once-in-a-career opportunity for me, by law, they cannot change that again for another 25 years. And you can do the math of what I was just talking about. In 25 years, I will not be here selling coins. So this is the only time I'm going to be able to get to sell the change, the transition of the American silver eagle. So when the American and Silver Eagle transition, even today, the regular mint state coin, which they're going to make tens of millions of, if you can find it, is going to be $149, $169, even $179. But this is the proof coin. So understand there isn't tens of millions or a million or even hundreds and hundreds of thousands. The United States government made this brand new proof silver. And what proof means, proof is not a condition. It's a method of manufacturing. The coins are made differently. They're struck multiple times under higher pressures. It is the collector version of the American Silver Eagle, and it is made in fantastically limited quantities. It's about 100 times rarer or more than the regular mint state American Silver Eagle. And I was able to say, because they sold out from the United States Mint instantaneously upon their release. They only made, I think, 200,000 coins total is all they made of the proof Silver Eagle, a coin they could have sold a million of or two million of. They made two million proof silver eagles in years past. So one of the most significant coins in United States Mint history, they made 200,000 that sold out about three minutes from the United States Mint. The proof coins sold out instantaneously. They went out in the marketplace and are almost impossible to find at any level, almost impossible to find. Well, I was able to put away, I put a few of these back. So like I said, I have 200 coins. 
The first time I offered these for this same exact price in the middle of July or the end of July of this year, I think we sold 3,000 coins, every single solitary coin I get my hands on. I have 200 now. I have 200 right here, right now. Now, the other thing about this is, so it's the brand new coin, the first year of issue. There is no substitute for the first year of issue. And remember, they made this coin for six weeks and six weeks only. They did not make it for the entire year like they have in past. The Proof of Regal is usually available for the entire year. The government does not sell them out. This year, they only made 200,000. They made them. They sold them out. They have not been available again from the United States Mint. So it is, I think, in my mind, doing the math, I think it's going to be the rarest West Point Mint or approved Silver Eagle in the entire new series. So not only is it first year of issue, it's going to be the rarest coin as well. On top of that, I have it in, in Proof 70 Ultra Cameo, which just means that Lady Liberty kind of jumps off the coin there. Proof 70, of course, means perfect. But the more important thing is that holder that you see it in. The Lady Liberty, the Liberty Core is what we call it. And this one's a dual core. Now, I have this exclusively, the dual core holder, where I have Lady Liberty on the front and I rechanged. So I did the new design on the back where the legal is literally holding the coin that you see right there. You can only get that from me and my company. It's 100% exclusive to us. Tremendous, tremendous, tremendous opportunity for you to be able to get this coin, own this coin. And sadly, I have less than 20 dozen. I think I'm down to probably 180 or so. So 15 dozen coins, I would think at the very most, is what we have. So first year of issue, completely and totally sold out from the United States government. My exclusive holder, done an absolutely perfect proof 70 that I have got right here. And this is the very last time again with this. These are my final Final quantities of this particular coin as well. Now understand, they're not making any more of these. I mean, they're never making any more proof type one or uh, type two American silver eagles, this brand new coin. They're already starting to make the 2022s. In the mid-state coin, they're already starting to make the 2022s. I can tell you what's done and gone in 2021 is done and gone. They're not making any more of these coins. So now this is where when we go back, you know, let's kind of go full circle here. Where I go back to where I was selling the coins, I remember in 1986, American Silver Eagles were really easy to get. I get American Silver Eagles, I think we sold them for $29.95. Of course, silver was $2.5 an ounce, I think, something like that. And, you know, with the mint premium and all, I mean, they were about 29 bucks. Certified Mint State 70, 1986 American Silver Eagle today, about 2000 bucks. So understand, just because you're close to the event, do not lose sight of its collectability. Do not lose sight of the fact that this is the first year of issue. And in that first year of issue, the most desirable coin in that first year of issue is always going to be the proof coin. It's always going to be the proof coin, the collector edition coin. And that's what you have here. And unfortunately, because of what the United States government did, is they didn't make enough coins. Traditionally, like next year for 2022, they're going to make the proof coins all year. They could make 300,000, 400,000, 500. They can make a million, 2 million, a million point six coins. This year, they made 200,000. They sold them out in one day, less than a day, sold them out in an hour, and never made any more coins. Absolute, unlike anything that I've seen from the United States Mint, what I would call guaranteed rarity. What I would call guaranteed rarity is what we're looking at in this, since I know they're not making any more, and I know it's a new series, and I can tell you this right now, there's going to be way more 2022s than there is of this. There's going to be way more 2023s, 2024s, 2025s. That's a given. That's a given. So get it now. Just because we have proximity to the event, do not lose sight of its rarity, collectability, and desirability the very first year in proof, in 70, in the exclusive holder, in stock, ready to ship. And you know if you're out there, I don't know, anything you're trying to buy, one of the keys to this, in stock. These are in stock, ready to ship. You do not have to wait. You're just not. You, you don't have to just hope that you get these. I think you get them in time for the holidays. Everything that I'm selling tonight, everything that I'm selling tonight in stock, ready to go.
okay, in stock ready to go. That's the way we do, try to do things here. And so this coin is absolutely positively no different. This coin I think is stunning. This coin is collectible because it is that first year of issue. It is my dual core holder, which is I think becoming fast, becoming one of the most popular holders, cores in the marketplace. It's absolutely stunning. It's certified perfect. It's a sold out limited edition. I've got unfortunately only a couple of hundred to go around. Fantastic, fantastic opportunity. Buy it now. Like I said, do not let the proximity to the release not let you understand how rare and collectible this will be this year, next year, the year after, the decade after, the generation after that. This will be the coin because it's the first year of issue. Absolutely. And Mike, you just kind of named off the trifecta, well, actually the quad, if I can say it that. Rarity, desirability, <laughs> collectability, availability <laughs> at the top of that list. So uh, basically, we have a few dozen. And the other thing that's important about this, not only an important coin to add to your collection, whether you're older, an avid collector, or not, that flex pay is open to anyone watching this show. And um, just because we get new shoppers on a minute by minute basis, understand that's that's HSN and Mike's commitment to you for a hundred nine dollars and ninety not ninety eight cents. You we have them. That's number one desirability, rarity, collectability, availability, but only if you're calling now. And that really is true because this is the last scheduled show for the year. Uh, more details at hsn.com. And of course, you can always rewind or watch the presentation if there's something that you missed. But definitely, you should take action on that. And uh, I know we've been referencing it throughout the show. Again, rarity, desirability, collectability, availability. You know, I could do my own little, I could, you know, create a cheer. Rarity, desirability, collectability, availability. We've got it if you're calling now. Um, Mike, as we scoot along though here, well, I was talking about the trifecta. You got a triple threat for us now, don't you? Well, here's, here's the other thing that happened. Because of a lot of things, okay, the United States government made the old design for the first half of 21, 2021, made the new design for the second half of 2021. And so here are all of the coins, the proof silver eagles. The United States government's never made really three proof silver eagles in a year before like this, particularly with two different designs, because this is the only year that they're, they're, they have or will make uh, two different designs in 60 years. So if we look at this right here, so you have the type one. So the last of the old school Silver Eagles, of course, it sold out instantaneously when it was released. I have 68 of the trios and that is it. I have 68 of the trios is all that I have on this particular one. When we go next door to that, you see the coin that I had in the middle, which was the West Point Minute, brand new type two American Silver Eagle. They also then did right next to it an S minted additional uh, ad on proof silver eagle i think they only made 175,000 of the s mints that you have right there so you have the w mint you have the s mint in the type two so the two type two proof silver eagles and the very last one the key to this the collectability of this the desirability of this to me in my mind is the fact that they're all dated 2021 the united states government a couple of times in their history has made two different designs of a denomination in a single year. 1909, for instance, they did the Indian Head Cent and the Lincoln Cent. So occasionally they do these transition coins, but they haven't done it in a very long time. So for them to do the transition of coinage in the same year, in a single year, is very unusual and makes it very desirable. So now you've got this unique numismatic event now combined with another unique numismatic event, the fact that they changed the design at all. And they did all of those changes in the same year. If you could real quickly, I know we have about a minute left, Shannon, if it's possible. Could you flip all those over? Yep, or do we have the, the backside of those, if yes, not? So sir. I want you to see. So you can see the dual core. So there you have the S mint. There you have the W mint. You can see the W and the S under the wing right there. And then you see the old school design that was on the American Silver Eagle for 35 years. All of it encapsulated in a single year. There's no S mint of the type 1 uh, uh, of the type ones from 2021. So this is the absolute complete proof silver eagle set from this most historic year, from this incredible year. So we have all three of them. I got five dozen of these sets in stock ready to go. That's it. And understand the W is hard, the S is hard. You know the hardest coin probably out of this collection? As rare and as desirable and as collectible as the type two. Try to get that coin all the way on the left. 
the type one W mint, all of a sudden that coin has absolutely positively disappeared from existence. All of a sudden that coin's like, where did those all go? Well, I mean, they sold out from the mint in you know, three minutes. And here's the thing, please understand, every mint issue that came from the United States Mint, I don't care what it was this year, basically. Morgan Silver Dollars, the Type 2 Silver Eagles, Type 1 Silver Eagles, Proof, I don't care what it was, they all sold out in about three minutes. Every single thing this year sold out instantly, wow. sold out instantly. So once again, we go back to a thing which traditionally, and you and I have been doing this for a long time now, we don't necessarily talk about availability. It's almost a given for what we've done over the course of the years, but it's not in the coin world today. And it's not in the world today, a given that they have the things that they're selling you. We have the coins to sell. We have the coins in stock. Do you realize how difficult that is? And that's what we have here. The entire Proof Silver Eagle collection in our exclusive holder, certified perfect, all the 2021s. Absolutely. Hey, Kevin, 12-month uh, VIP financing, I think you told me that, yes? Uh, 70, oh, 18 months, sorry. And that made it about $77, wow. oh, $72. I was trying to do that from memory. So uh, $72 on your HSN card, 18-month VIP financing. My producer did confirm that, like I said, uh, someone holds the balance books or the balance sheet on that, and you're not. So you can certainly meter those payments out. Hey, HSN Cares is dedicated to empowering women and, of course, helping families in times of need. Join HSN Cares in support of St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital so that families never receive a bill from St. Jude for treatment, travel, housing, or food. We're highlighting powerful patient stories like Colton's throughout the campaign. When I grow up, I want to be a nurse for St. Jude or just a doctor. Could they help me? I want to return the favor and help other kids. I had pain in my side, and then it got worse and worse. And then when we got to St. Jude, she just told me it's a tumor, and then I was kind of scared, but not really. Some days you feel really bad, and some days you feel really good. My doctor said, um, you have no more cancer, and we were like, oh my gosh, I can go back to having fun. I can be a kid again. Unbelievable. I know anytime we see one of those stories, we certainly get moved. And we have such generous customers and, and friends who are part of our family. Of course, you can visit HSN Cares at hsn.com for more patient stories and, more importantly, information on how to donate because together we make a difference and any dollar donation or amount makes a big, big difference indeed. So thank you again for that. We're gonna do a little time out. We've got more with the King of Coins, his last scheduled show for the rest of the year. Stay tuned. What really separates a house from a home? A home should provide comfort, coziness, and convenience. Join me on Monday nights where I'll be giving you great ideas for your home, your kitchen, and your life. HSN, we love our crafters. So we're bringing you top-rated picks crafters love. It was so easy to use. Plus, experts will share their top tips. Join us on our next craft event tonight. Bam! It's our biggest foodie event of the season. HSN's Let's Cook for the Holidays kicks off with celebrity chefs Curtis Stone and Wolfgang Puck for 24 hours of culinary deals and gourmet food all on four flex pay. Iron Chef Bo Mack makes his debut and don't miss the premiere of celebrity chef Emerald, who has returned with brand new ways to cook like a pro. I'm back at HSN, where we always kick it up a notch. All day Friday on HSN and November 12th through 16th at hsn.com. Hi, I'm Jay King, and one of my fondest Christmas memories is the New Mexico Christmas. New Mexico Christmas is so special because I guarantee you we get the family together. There's going to be two things on the menu. There's going to be red chili and green chili. It really makes the event. Some like it hot. Who knew, Jay King? I mean, seriously, boy, the hotter the better for me. Um, actually, well, things are getting hot in here, especially if you are a coin collector, because this is the last show, last show for the rest of the year in our coin collector. Uh, and of course, Mike Nizak, who is joining us um, from his 
ample library <laughs> to share all. Indeed. The, exactly, indeed. Uh, all the great information. Mike, we did, did, did a double check on that Morgan and that piece said as experience, you know, as we thought would happen, you know, people are still shopping and buying for that. But um, I know you're making, everybody's watching and listening and learning, just be aware, last show for the year. All right, let's start off this segment of time together in the Coin Collector. Now, designer edition. Now, this, Describe this because when I think of designer, I think you know designer jeans or designer handbags. But <laughs> but, but but this right. does actually have like a, a a designated descriptor or more than just an adjective. This is a also like a special edition, is it not? Yeah, and understand, I'm not the one that that designated this the designer edition. Okay. The United States Mint issued this, and they called it their designer edition. I'm just. <laughs> I think we've established over the course of the years that as, as numismatists and coin collectors, we're, we're not very inventive. I mean, we're more descriptive than inventive, okay? So we basically just copied the name from the mint. <laughs> you know, they, they say it's the designer edition. We say, okay, it'll be the designer edition. And we say it's reverse proof. Well, that's what the United States Mint said. It was it was uh, reverse proof. Now, so here, here's what happened. So they, so they j changed this coin design, okay? They changed this coin design. Uh, mid-year, in essence. Uh, uh, they did the old design until June 30th. They did the new design starting July 1st. Well, they decided to commemorate that intra-year transition, if you will, by dusting off a, uh, a design way of making the coins, which is reverse proof. It's a process that the United States Mint hasn't done in many, many, many years. It's a very technically exacting process, and it has been one of the most popular over the course of the years, one of the most popular uh, designs that the United States government does is this reverse proof. And what do they mean by that is a proof coin, as we saw earlier, is where they, uh, the field of the coin or kind of the, the, you know, the open part of the field of the coin is the shiny part and the device of the coin, which is the design of the coin is kind of matte finished. In a reverse proof, it's backwards. So it's struck differently. And so you have this reverse proof. So the United States government did these two coin sets and they released them together. It is the only set that the United States government put out specifically just type one, type two silver eagles. And they did it in this reverse proof. Of course, it sold out in two minutes or three minutes from the United States Mint. Uh, uh, it was just an instantaneous thing. I think the coins are absolutely stunning. So what I was able to do is get a small quantity of these, and I sold this one other time before. So this, and this will be the last time, again, that I'm gonna air this. I got 96 sets, that's all we've got. Done, gone, and over, 96 sets. To start with, the flag core is my exclusive core at NGC. Nobody else can sell flag core but me. I'm the only I'm the only purveyor of the flag core at NGC. More importantly, I have these from the first day of issue. And I'm out of first day of issues. Now, I'll be able to bring some of these back probably. I don't know if I can do this price, but they won't be first day of issue. And the NGC first day of issue is a very exclusive designation. Basically, I think we have 36 hours or something like that, 48 hours at the most, to get the coins at NGC. So it, remain, it, it basically entails flying stuff around and overnighting and all this other stuff just to make sure that, the, uh, that NGC has the coins right after from that very first day of issue. And in, not only from the first day of issue, but in their hands from the first day of issue. So it's a very exclusive designation. And so Flag Corps first day of issue, to my mind, is probably the most exclusive NGC designation of them all. First of all, first day of issue absolutely is. And then add in the flag core, which is probably the most restrictive of all the cores, since I sell it exclusively. And then you take this coin set that is the, it, this is the set the United States government intended to show the transition from one type from the old design to the new design. And they did so by doing it in one of their most difficult, most technically difficult uh, designs that they have in what they call the reverse proof. And so the problem with this is, 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 you know, you can find these sets out there. Of course, they sell for a tremendous premium to their original issue price from the United States Mint. But what you can't do is you can't send in and get any more first day of issues from NGC. So what exists, it exists. That's it. There is no more. 
There will never be any more first day of issue flag cores. What I have here, these remaining 96, 95, 94 sets, 93 sets is all that are in existence for this 92 sets that you see right there to be able to have this in first day of issue flag court. Now, so, and, and I don't want to harp too much on first day of issue flag court. I mean, it's very, it's an extraordinarily exclusive designation. Like I said, you can only get it from me. First day of issue in any court is difficult to get NGC and always brings a tremendous premium. So I want to focus for just a minute on the coin itself. What I want to focus on is this reverse proof. And, and like I said, we're, we're close to the United States Mint having released these coins. And so now it seems like they're easy to get. You know what I'm saying? It, you know, you, look, you can find them here. You can find them there. They may have them. They may not have them. But you see them. All I can do is tell you and bring 35, 40 years of uh, numismatic experience to bear here and tell you we get past this event pretty quickly. Before you know it, Boom, you're in 2023, you're in 2024, and where'd all the 2021s go? Already, they're in short supply in their year of issue. That is a relative rarity. So now imagine a year from now, two years from now, three years from now, five years now, 10 years from now, when people are now back collecting, where this is the eagle, the only eagle they may well know. And that first or original design American Silver Eagle that you see right there is the coin that they can aspire to. But this is the coin that everybody wants. And the set that everybody will want that is the transition set is the designer set. And that's a set that has been designated by the United States Mint as its designer set and designer edition. That's not a Mike Mezak day. The United States Mint said, look, this is the set. And to designate it and make it special and let it know, be known that this is the only set that we released where it was type one, type two together, just the Silver Eagles like this, we're going to give it this special reverse proof designation and design. They did no other reverse proof Silver Eagles during the course of the year. They only came in this set. They only came this way. They only came in the designer edition. And then within the designer edition, that first day of issue becomes even more difficult to get, becomes even more desirable, becomes even more collectible in that first day of issue. And so that, I think, is really critically important for you to understand that there's that opportunity. And once again, just like the flag core, uh, with this in the flag core, just like I had the special MGC Morgans to lead the show, basically the advanced release Morgans in my special designated holder right here, this is the last time you're going to see the flag core first day of issues. This is it. This is my final presentation of this prime time or otherwise it's my final presentation for first day of issue american silver eagle designer series sets and so it's not just that it's perfect not just that it's reverse proof not just that it's flag core but also we add in just this one time and one time only we're able to get this first day of issue we're rarely able to get flag core is rare enough on its own flag core first day of issue like i said that is what they aspire to uh what most uh, uh, coin collectors aspire to be able to collect flag core first day of issue because it is the top of the top the best of the best the cream of the crop is what you've got there well you do indeed but you know like you said for a handful of people who are able to select it this is also one that we have selected to be on 18 month vip financing which once more takes you know a considerable amount of buying power on our end you know somebody's holding that balance sheet which means for 66 dollars and 66 cents when you use your hsn credit card then you create your own interest-free uh, payments and, you know, dole that out as uh, over the course of those 18 months. And yet you still get that unconditional money-back guarantee as part of our holiday, that extended holiday return policy until the end of January. So certainly if you are interested, I, it's, it, it's interesting because, um, Mike, you were talking about this, but the reverse proof in particular, I, I think this is the only... This, is this the only reverse proof set that I have seen this year? I mean, there are so many things that set it apart. But In the Silver Eagle, yeah. It's the first Silver Eagle reverse proof you've seen since 2016, as a matter of fact. Wow. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, they just don't make, uh, they just don't make, I mean, uh, they debuted it, uh, you know, many years ago. 2012 was the first reverse proof. They made it from 2012 to 2016. They have not made another reverse proof Silver Eagle from 2016 till now. All right. So there's only a ha half a dozen reverse proof, different reverse proof Silver Eagles that have ever been made. 
And of course, as a set that you see like this, where you have the type one and type two with the transition and both of the coins, both designs are both dated 2021. Do not overlook the fact that the collectability of the transition happening in tree year. Now, you know, like I said, we're it, we're in the year, so it, it doesn't seem as special as what it will a year from now, two years from now, five years from now, 10 years from now. That's when you, that's when it's really going to stand up uh, and be and be the collectible, I think, that it really is here. Uh, most definitely. I mean, striking to be sure. I mean, there, there's something captivated about that reverse proof, that uh, method of manufacturing. Remember, interest-free payments, whether you're doing the 18-month VIP financing or not, in which case, if you use your major credit card, PayPal debit card, less than $400, but yet not like a layaway plan, we zip it off to you. Well, you won't have to wait much further to see some of our 